Hobart School of Welding Technology presents Training in Gas Tungsten Arc Welding. Topic number 10, Job Practice. Square Groove Weld, Guided Bend Test. The objective of this job practice is to pass a guided bend test on 11 gauge mild steel welded in the flat position. Material, 11 gauge mild steel, electrode, 1% thoriated tungsten, 1 8 inch diameter. Shielding gas, argon, welding grade. Filler metal, E70S3, 1 8 inch diameter. Equipment, power source, AC-DC combination. Collet and collet body, 1 8 inch. Nozzle, 3 8 inch inside diameter. Protective clothing, gloves, and helmet. Wire brush, wire cutters, and pliers. Using two pieces of 5 inch by 6 inch 11 gauge steel, prepare a workpiece and deposit a single square groove weld using the same procedures outlined in topic 9. Weld along the 6 inch edge to form a 6 inch by 10 inch piece. Present the completely welded specimen to your instructor for visual inspection. The standards of acceptability are cracks. A weld shall be acceptable by visual inspection if there are no cracks. Joint penetration. The root of the weld should show no evidence of incomplete penetration. Fusion. There must be complete fusion between weld metal and base metal. Tungsten inclusions. The weld shall show no evidence of containing any tungsten inclusions. Porosity. There shall be no porosity exceeding a maximum of 1 16th inch and there shall be no more than the combined total of 1 8th inch of porosity in any 1 square inch of weld. The face reinforcement shall be a minimum of flush with the base metal to a maximum of 1 8th inch. The root reinforcement shall be a minimum of flush with the base metal to a maximum of 1 16th inch. Reinforcement for both the face and the root must blend smoothly into the plates with transition areas free from edge weld undercut. If the weld passes visual inspection, prepare the workpiece for the guided bend test. Cut a 1 and 1 8 inch wide strip from one edge of the piece and discard it. From the same side, cut two 1 and 1 inch wide straps, which will be used for the bend test. The remaining piece should be discarded. Now, mark one end of both test strips with your own identification. Grind the root and the face of the weld flush with the surface of the base metal. Be sure to grind in a direction parallel to the length of the straps. Do not grind across the weld face or the strap will be weakened and may fail. Now grind a 1 8 inch radius on the corner of each strap. In a guided bend fixture, bend one strap with the face side up and the other strap with the root side up. The standards of acceptability are the guided bend specimens shall have no open defects exceeding 1 8 inch measured in any direction on the convex surface of the specimen except that cracks occurring on the corners of the specimen shall not be considered unless there is definite evidence that they result from tungsten inclusions or other internal defects. Analyze the test results and check with your instructor. 